So I just received a question on my review on the Bofang UV 5G Mini, and I wanted to answer this question. So this is from Summer Wind Charters, talking about the UV 5G Plus, how they've been using it for a year, and asking if the UV 5G Mini has an easier to use menu system. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually show you the differences between the menu system on the UV 5G Plus and the UV 5G Mini. So here's the menu options for the UV 5G Plus. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the menu button and just scroll through a few menu options here. You can see step, uh, SQL, version, stopwatch, and various menu options on the UV 5G Plus. Gonna go ahead and swap this out now for the UV 5G Mini so you can see the difference. So now check out the menu system on the UV 5G Mini to compare. I'm gonna go ahead and hit menu. Got a various menu options here that you can select. These are sub menus. So it's not just one big menu list like you get on the UV 5G Plus. It's actually broken out into various categories. For example, programs and frequencies have its own section, which is where you can program, for example, your CTCSS privacy codes and other settings, hit back. And then you have kind of a general radio settings menu, which has things like a vox level, and you're gonna have, for example, whether you wanna turn the voice on or off, the radio, you have the backlight options and things like that. So as you can see, the menu is definitely more intuitive and a lot easier to read and use. I hope that answers your question and I'll see you in the next video.